Well guys, we snuck in here this morning. Well, like I said, my buddy Jason came over and popped this blind up for me uh, yesterday afternoon. I was in the field till 10.30 last night and uh, went and picked up Dylan this morning and we got in here and we were within 50 yards where they were roosted. We could look out the blind window and uh, see them roosted up there and we had uh, one goblin and there was another one just south of us goblin and uh, some raccoons started fighting and he actually went further into the timber uh, once they quit and moved out, we kept calling and he came back. Well, he came in behind the blind and for whatever reason he spooked. I mean, we didn't make a sound. I don't know if he saw something that he didn't like in the decoys or what, but he ended up going behind us about five, six yards and we couldn't see him. We just kept calling and this guy came out here south of us uh, and he came sprinting to the decoys. Um, he had gobbled a couple times this morning, but he was, he was pretty quiet. But uh, we stayed with it and uh, made a great shot. Uh, used a East and Full Metal Jacket arrow, and uh, it went clean through him. Uh, I was holding my pin right on his right on his waddle, and it went in and broke his neck and came out the other side. So it went clean through him. I shot him about 10 yards, and uh, I'm pretty happy to say the least. It's been a quick season for me, which is unusual. But now I get the chance to film Dylan and. Uh, get after it with Morgan also so I want to thank you guys for watching it was fun bringing it to you <laughs>